The Fed is in a tricky situation. Is there any way that they can get out of this? Is there any good path for them? I don't see it. See, here's what the Fed's trying to do. They, uh, they need to normalize the balance sheet, meaning get the balance sheet down to maybe $2 trillion. Right now it's over four. It's coming down a little bit, but it's a long way between four trillion and two trillion. Bearing in mind, in 2008 it was 800 billion, so even two trillion would be a big increase. And they need to normalize interest rates, which means getting from one percent to three, three and a quarter. Um, but the question is, how do you get there? So the Fed's trying to raise interest rates 25 basis points, four times a year, every March, June, September, December through 2019 to get to three and a half percent or so and bring down the balance sheet. They're going to be reducing it uh, by the end of next year by $50 billion a month, which is a lot. And there's some estimates that the impact of that is equivalent to a one percentage point rate hike because it is a form of tightening. You're reducing the money supply. You're reducing base money. Uh, the question is, why are they doing it? Why are they doing it in a kind of relatively weak economy? The answer is they're preparing for the next recession. They want to run the playbook again, which is cut rates and then go to QE4, QE5. How do you prepare for the next recession without causing the recession you're preparing to cure? That's the finesse. That's the problem. And I don't think they can do it.